getting fired from Wooster Street Social Club was probably one of the best things that ever happened to me. I can give a shit what any of them are doing. I've constantly invited Megan out, constantly invited Billy out, but he didn't come. Just anything I ever invited anybody to. It was, it was like they had something better to do. I don't know who they think they are, but I don't give a shit about the fucking Wooster Street Social Club. Worcester Social, how can I help you? What's up, Jess? <laughs> What's going on, Mr. Chris Torres? I'm thinking, what the hell does he want? A little birdie tells me that a whole bunch of people have been calling over there for me. You got some names and numbers for me or what? Dude, I'm not giving you anything. That's very inconsiderate of you. That's no way to get an apprenticeship, Jessica. Typical Chris trying to blackmail me for something that happened months ago. Hey, Chris. I could be an amazing apprentice. I'm staying here for my own reasons. I'm not an idiot. I stay where my heart is. All right, Jess, so you're wasting my time? You're not going to give me the client list? I called it for nothing. <laughs> All right, I got to get back to work. What is going on here, ladies? Who just called? Chris Is that Chris? Chris? What the Chris. did he want? Hit a client list. Listen, if that idiot calls one more time, you let me know. Chris calling my shop is like being threatened with herpes every day. There's not a day that goes by that I don't feel like pulling Chris out of his house and beating his teeth in. But someone's already beat me to that.